Wake up, wake up. Anyway, yo, we got grand finals going on here. Give me that. <laughs> Give me that. <laughs> Poor favor. All right, here we go. All right, here we go, folks. Grand finals coming up for you guys here at uh at Overclock One. Late in DMG, Maddie G, or 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 a newly minted uh, Daijo Boo. Yeah, there uh, we Maddie go. G and Lade. Brand new team made uh, by New England for New England. Already picked up some of the best to ever do it as we head into game one here. And I'm already seeing So the edge guard game for this is going to be crazy because we have Maddie G, right? Maddie G playing the Chrome. That's just, the spells trouble in its own. You know, it's like, all right, how do we kill him as quickly, as efficiently as possible? I know one way. Yeah, man. Daddy-daughter uh, bonding coming out yeah. uh, for these guys. So usually it just works out. It's going to be a lot of damage and a lot of stocks. Uh, being thrown around right now because both Lucina and Krom hit so hard. It runs in the family oh, for sure. Dude, like, yeah, for sure. That is definitely, I, I don't know which chromosome it's on, but. Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> yeah the, the eugenics in his family run, uh, run very strong. Yeah, do that Punnett square. Figure out what, what the answer is there. You know what the crazy thing is? Uh, a lot of people don't know this, but in the event, I don't know if we'll see it in this set, but if Maddie G does decide to use his ether on stage uh, and land on stage with it, if Don uses the flood, it'll push him off the stage and put him in a free fall. Wow, that's interesting. Yeah, that's crazy. Flood will do that to certain up bees when they land on stage. It'll push you off in free fall. You can't recover. So we might see it. We might not. But it's definitely useful to know in the matchup. That could have been very scary right there for Light. But fortunately, on the other end of that Aether coming out. Punish? Oh, no. He got mixed. He got mixed. All right, see, you see Laid opting to play uh, lead right now. Manny G just opting to sit back. Oh, he just beat her at support. Yeah, that happens. Sometimes you go out and try to counter the, uh, the Firefox. Uh, and sometimes they just manage to grab Light before you can. And like, but the only other option is to like go for a safe spike. And we all know Light's gonna tech it. So yeah, <laughs> I haven't seen Light miss a tech in like three years. Yeah, he, the only time he misses a tech is when it's untouchable. Yeah, <laughs> it's, mean, when it's, like, gets, it's when technology <laughs> says he can. Oh wow, I like the back and forth between Late and Maddie G there, getting the juggles with the up tilts together. Oh pass. Oh, nice tech from Light managing to get down. Dashboard. Oh. Okay. I like get daily double there, get the kill, and Maddie G's gonna survive, so that is a favorable trade for Team Yellow. I wonder why they go Yellow Team. Maybe they just like the colors. I, yeah, think, I, it looks nice. I think it looks nice. Blondes have more fun, man. Yeah, you're right. <laughs> Krom's colors are kind of ugly, though. I'm not gonna. I'm gonna be real. Yeah. I, I, I like this color for Krom, but like, I think he has like one good color. Maybe oh yeah, two. I'm a big fan of the Cromsicle, without a doubt. Oh. But, uh, <laughs> so Maddie G's shield looking really uh, loose Ooh, right there. Maddie there G's we go. Looking real. Oof, right? Yeah. <laughs> There we go, the up smash gets the job done, but uh, Light is definitely one up uh, smash attack away from eating his demise. Yeah, and I actually like that uh, you saw Light doing the rapid jabs and Don came with the up smash. He was like, one of us is going to shield poke, right? Unfortunately for them, they did not get it, but they made his shield, uh, as people like to say, a skittle. <laughs> oh, there okay. go. Oh. Like the handoff right there, but unfortunately, uh, the yellow team is still going to find himself in a deficit right now. Back here, coming down, dashing back, forward tilt. Wow. Oh, so good. I swear, man. Like, I mean, it's uh, it's no secret that Krom is Frankenstein's Fire Emblem character. <laughs> like, my God, that F tilt is, has no business being that strong. Down tilt into the border. And the swing from Don. Ooh, is likely to be able to follow up on that. Not quite. But I love that the awareness is always there. They're always ready and waiting. Yeah, that's the beauty about swords, man. So right now, like you said, Flambo, Don kind of sitting in the, the danger zone right now. First one to go out, probably determines who's gonna lose his first game here. But don't wanna jinx it quite yet. We're gonna see who's gonna be able to find that conversion. I feel like Oh, oh, oh my god. He has to up be. Oh my wow! Or smash oh he back tilts in the wrong direction. See, I thought Kool-Aid was gonna forward smash in that direction. And then Maddie G would just forward tilt the other side and they cover both. But either way, they still managed to, to close out the set there. It was looking a little scary yep. toward the end there. Um it was especially weird how he managed to get the two frame with a down air, but it wasn't the sweet spot. And Light was able to just kind of like air dodge back on stage to the, the the sour spot of the down air. Yeah, man, without a doubt, that was that, that definitely flowed. You know, ebbed and flowed a little bit more than I'm sure uh, you know, either team would have liked. But you know, Laid and Maddie G coming out on the positive end of that first game. Oh, Lila, yeah, Lila. I'm like, Lila, who? Lila don't know her. I'm, I'm hip. I'm like, do we have that in our stages? I'm about to say. Hey. Yo, pirate ship? Oh, pirate ship? <laughs> Yo, gentlemen's the big blue. Come on. Yo, you remember in uh, in elementary school when they would tell you to say pirate ship with your tongue out? 
<laughs> yeah. Yeah. <laughs> it's a classic. Jeez, man. Or, or they would tell you to spell I cup, and you'd be like, I cup? Uh, <laughs> oh, I gotcha. <laughs> Oh, man. No, there was this kid that like tried to hit me. He's like, "Oh, you left something under there," and then you say "underwear," and they're like, "Ah, oh, oh, you said underwear." No. But no. I just like wasn't saying it, and the guy just got so mad at me. <laughs> he's like, "Hey, you left something under there." I'm just like, "You mean this?" He's just like, "No, I meant like under there." I'm just like, "Where, where are you pointing to?" He's like, "Just say underwear, <laughs> idiot." For it, please. <laughs> Let me have my serotonin. But my girlfriend's watching, man. Come on. <laughs> oh man, here's a throwback. Oh for dude. You. I gotta say, big fan of the new Animal Crossing music in this game. We. I mean, I, what is it? I, I, there's that meme that was going around on t Twitter that was like uh, uh, Animal Crossing fans and Splatoon fans, and then it had the, the like handshake yeah. in the middle where it's like <laughs> lyrics that don't make any damn sense. <laughs> 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 but they're bangers, though. <laughs> That's for sure. They're bangers. KK <laughs> Go KK Ryder. KK Slaps. Slaps. Oh, my goodness. I remember I had the, uh, the Through the Fire and Flames like version on my Brawl mod back in the day. <laughs> No, I forget who it was like a KK slider version of like sickle mode. Oh, I oh, heard that, it? dude. Oh <laughs> my god. Bad. Bad up, bad up. Beat my matey bo. I'm just like, what? How did I end up on this part of the internet? <laughs> All right. Lead us to say, smack. Oh, okay. oh, no. There we go. Gravity having its way with light right there. Oh, not. No, 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 no. Oh, oh my god. No. It happened twice, twice in a row. He's out like a light. <laughs> like a light, man. I. This game just started, bro. And what Don happened? almost got caught in a crossfire right there. That was absolutely insane, That's man. Not I even saw the light face. He was just like, bro, really? <laughs> like, come on. <laughs> the, the great reversal of fortune right there for the uh, the yellow team as probably the most, you know, no shade towards Don, but light's definitely like, you know, the the weapon X. In yeah, the, in this exactly, scenario. man. Like, it's the X factor, but it's just on all the time. Oh, okay. I like that dash. Uh, Fox tried to come out for Kool-Aid there to avoid that attack and try to get, and get a hit of his own. Going on off stage. Yes, forward throw. He's going to charge up that flood and on the other side. Almost a KO. He's going to air dodge the leg. Smart by Maddie G. Yeah, I was going to say, Maddie G's really good at just like uh, not utilizing the air dodge immediately. Like using forward air to kind of push his momentum uh, towards the ledge before having to rely on the direction right. of the air dodge. Because usually when you see, uh, there we go, a fortunate team fire right there, or friendly fire gonna come at EG because like usually when you see people play characters with like bad uh, recoveries they'll immediately buffer the direction exactly. of dodge and then save their double jump but they just go out there and get hit but yeah really, really good resource management like, yeah you have to be careful and you also got to mix it you know, that's the move you got to keep your opponent on your toes but also sometimes you want to rely on your partner to save you and speaking of relying on your partner to save you there was nothing light could have done there for that up air that kool-aid just unleashed uh I don't know, did I get that wrong? I might have got that wrong. Whatever. We, we were, man. <laughs> I was like, wait a second. Hey, man, it's Animal, <laughs> <laughs> animal it's Crossing. Animal Crossing, man. <laughs> Definitely messed that up. Ooh, there we go. And light, uh, like you said, out like a light. Damn. Um, hey. hey, somebody had to make a joke. Yeah, I'm saying. If it wasn't going to be you, it was going to be me. So. Royalties to Cooper. Yeah. <laughs> So yeah, so now Don, Don and Light uh, have their backs against the wall right now. Maddie G and Lade just being uh, kind of autumn like white on rice right now. Like yeah. that, that again, they've just like they seize the lead and they just haven't given it back. Good tech there from Lade. Uh, and actually, I, I love seeing the evolution of Lade. As someone who sees him play every week at the local, he's been incorporating. I mean, he, he took Leffen's advice to, to put it lightly. He's, been trying to go off stage more and edge guard as much as he can. You can see it with how aggressive he's been off stage all set. Yeah, without a doubt. Ooh, that could have been a. Uh, yeah, it, it's a rough position for both members of the green team right now. So light losing the. Oh. oh lord. Oh, baby, what happened? So once again, uh, daddy daughter bonding going very well for Krom and Lucina right there. Bro, as they, I swear their uh, their win pose, like their win sequence. I swear it's in. in Tune. Like they put their sword away in the exact same frame. <laughs> <laughs> they pra they've been practicing that for weeks. <laughs> Needless to say, man, uh, you know that early like loss of two stocks right there from from Light against Maddie G yeah, definitely uh, set the, the tone for the rest of that game right bad, there. Bad man. And then we're both to the uh, the ether, right? The up where he grabs ledge, but you don't catch it later, man. Unfortunately, he's going ahead. I see you, Light. Uh, whispering something to Don's ear there. I think he said, mess him up. <laughs> you know, it's crazy, because my favorite thing to do on commentary is to guess what the players are whispering to each other, because when you talk to them after, usually it's never anything that serious. You know what I mean? Sometimes it's like, oh man, you gotta stop hitting me. And then that's <laughs> it, you know what I mean? Or 
Sometimes it's actually tragedy. Yeah, they give you like Captain Little Roman advice. <laughs> <laughs> it's like uh, when uh, randos who go 0-2 and their locals go into a, a top player stream and they say, how do I get better? You know what I mean? And they just say like, just play more. You know, it's like he's whispering to you, just, just, just play more. <laughs> And then it's like, what, what, what is Gil there? But we're going to go ahead and go into what could potentially be the last match of doubles for Overclock if Maddie G are going to go, uh, Maddie G and Laid win this right here. That could be tournament's point. There you shall see. <laughs> so Laid, uh, definitely I don't think he meant to do that uh, that, way, that way. Wow, I don't know what happened right there no. from Laid, but dropping a little too low there. And once again, a low percent stock lock. Uh, it's going to put the green team in the early deficit once again. Giving me flashbacks to game two. Cannot start off like this. Light's gonna have to play twice as hard now to make sure that he can make up for the stock that he just lost. Yeah, man. And like, you know, it's it's unfortunate for Fox. Like, he had like some of the best recovery and ledge tools like in Smash 4, and now he kind of has to wait in line like the rest of us. Mm. So, uh, yeah, sure. you know, it is it is quite you know the unfortunate fate right there. But nonetheless, oh, that was a nice catch right there. Oh, dude, the react. I wish I had that type of reaction time just in general. Like they just stop on a dime and like kick someone with my foot. F token hit its mark though, so Light once again finds himself at a, uh, a two stock deficit, and we're not even a uh, full two minutes into the game yet. Yeah, this is not looking good for the boys in green, but boys. Oh my yellow. god! Oh no! Please. That's how you know everything's just coming up late right now. Like the, the, the yellow team is pro is is glowing. Uh, shout out to DaiJobu.gg for the sponsor power up. I'm saying though. <laughs> Give him that extra boost of confidence because, man, green team in shambles. Yeah, Lane and Matty G have just had a dominant control of the last. You know, again, those dominant starts are just so hard to rebound from. But needs to say, Don and Lane continuing to fight right now. Oh, okay. We're going to get a little bit of a, a team kill right there, but also kill on the enemy. Since they're already so ahead, and Stocks are willing to take that trade. Ooh. You know, it's weird. You'd think that, like, down throw fair for Mario would be much better as Lay just comes up short on that ledge right there. So, uh, we're actually even again, but yeah. it'll be a light being at a, a very high percent right now. Uh, excuse me? Oh. Do you mind? Yeah, I was, I was like, can we press pause on the cassette for a second? On the TiVo? <laughs> <laughs> can I get the record? You're probably wondering how I got in this situation. All right. Oh, yeah. <laughs> oh no. Oh, oh no. Yep, the share socks, we immediately lose the sock at zero. This is actually crazy. I don't know how Light lost socks like that and somehow uh, is the one who's alive right now. Yeah. But <laughs> with that said, the yellow team looking primed and ready to take this this entire tournament for doubles. I mean, unless Light about to turn the Jets on, it's looking like a wrap, man. I, I don't want to put the nail in the coffin, but... Yeah, it, it, the coffin's pretty much almost closed at this point. Up smash is going to be a good start, though, so, uh, you know, uh, Laid is going to be forced to share stock. Let's see if we got quick gimps coming out. Oh, how about this? The back air connects, and there we go, ladies and gentlemen. Your overclocked ultimate champions. Four teams. Daijobi, uh, Matty G, and Laid. Yeah, in a convincing manner as well. These two really, I'm, they probably dropped a game here and there, maybe. Uh, in their way. Yeah, but those last two games, top, incredibly but, dominant. Um, now, I'll even take a look. You know, 3 0 in winners' finals, 3 0 against Mr. Ian DeBuzz, 3 0 against a uh, Jewel and Professor or something. MG, MGW. And then, yeah, these guys just kind of. Wow. Oh, wait, no, this is the wrong side. Yeah, 3 1. Okay, so they dropped the 2 1 to Pelka and Mr. Ryan Ness, but everything other than that has been a body bag. They dropped one game.